In this video, I am going to show you how to create a collaborative project for you guys to work on. Since I am using a real account to show you how this works, I will be blurring out names of any student or any student information. So you would start here in the dashboard. One person out of your group would go to Projects, Create New Projects. You add in a title. Click on Collaborative, click Next. You will see your grade here. Click on that, click Next. You would search for your classmates, whoever is in your project group in here. So you type in a last name. You would click that student. You would click Next. If you had videos already recorded, you would see those here. If you are not using those for the project, you do not select them. And then you click Next, and it creates the project. Here you can either select Create Video or Finish. If you create video, you go right into creating a video. If you click Finish, you go to your dashboard. I am going to show you the dashboard. So here you can see there are two members. So if you click that, you see both students. You want to be sure all of your group members are in here. If you go back to edits, you can hit new video, start, or new edit down here. And they all go to the same place as that create video link did when you were creating this, when we clicked finish. So if you click any of those, they go to the same place. And you can click blank edit start and now from this view you want to click the media folder you would click this record button right here webcam you want to allow allow i have my camera turned off so you can't see me right now on your video, when you are doing this, you will see you and whatever your background is behind you in this view. You wanna make sure that the entire background behind you is what you want it to be. If you're doing a green screen, make sure your entire background behind you is green. You click Start Recording, and it will count down for you from three, two, one, and then it would be recording you. So this is where you would be doing your project. While it's recording, if you find that you mess up, that's okay. Just keep recording. I would pause your conversation just for a moment so you know where to go back to for editing purposes and it's easier. But I would keep recording. When you are done, you will click Save. You can, if you have time, record again, but it is easy to edit your video so you don't have to keep recording again and again. When you're done, you can click Save, and it will pop up in your screen right here. One last step you want to do in order to make sure that your group can see the video is you wanna make sure you drag it down into video one or video two. Since you will be doing, if you're doing a green screen, you wanna drag it down to video two, and then you'll want to save it. So. I am going to go ahead, I'm just gonna drag this one that has no image on here. Drag it down and then I'm going to save it. So you click this over here, this little main menu, save. So once you have done that, your group, whoever you have shared your collaboration project with should be able to see this video. And that is all for this video.